Ladies and gentlemen, the NFL is back. Football is back and everybody is rejoicing. If you are as excited as I am that we have football back, hit the subscribe button. Salute to everybody. We had the New York Jets versus the Cleveland Browns tonight. Uh, this was an unbelievable preseason game. Very, uh, it was a great encounter. A lot of a lot of players showed a lot of great signs. So we got to definitely break it all down. Um, so it was definitely, the lights even went out and all. You know, um, Tom Benson Hall of Fame Stadium, you know, has some rust to start off the new year. We just got to keep it all the way 100 with you. Um, the score tonight, the Jets did fall despite, you know, looking like I thought they was going to take off on them, but it, they, they fell 16 to 21. Um, Zach Wilson, we'll get into that shortly. I like what I've seen, uh, but the Browns pay homage. Salute to everybody rocking with the Cleveland Browns. They are a team that's going to be a threat. Um, e even the lights at Thomas Benson Hall of Fame Stadium had his rust. Um, in the first NFL game of the 2023 season on Thursday night. But it worked in the Cleveland Browns advantage as they took down the Jets 21 to 16 in the annual Hall of Fame game. With the third quarter at the end, the lights went out and needed some time to get back on to resume the final quarter of this game. And when they turned back on, Dorian Thompson Robinson, a fifth round pick, by the Browns in this year's draft out of UCLA shine bright. He orchestrated a 10 play 78 yard touchdown drive that was capped with a 22 yard strike to Austin Watkins to give the Browns a 21-16 lead. Truly spectacular, ladies and gentlemen. This is how you kick off, you know, football. Thompson Robinson also showed off his speed, rushing for 37 yards on five carries. He threw for 82 yards on eight of 11 through the air. Unbelievable. Um, his competition to Deshaun Watson's backup this season is Minnesota Vikings third round pick from the 2021 NFL Draft. Um, Keelan Moon, who got the start for Cleveland in this one, he finished his night 13 of 19 with one touchdown and one interception. On the other sideline, Aaron Rodgers, Sauce Gardner, and other bona fide stars were in shorts and t-shirts rooting for their teammates, one of which being Zach Wilson, the number two overall pick in the 2021 NFL Draft. Zach Wilson, Aaron Rodgers expected backup for this season. We all know that. And that situation has turned out better than a lot of people expected. Everybody thought that it was going to be some kind of riff riffraff beef. Or, and it, it's really been a big brother situation. I think Zach Wilson is going to be an elite quarterback. You know, so just, just he just need to trust the process. He's going to be just like Rodgers. He's going to be like, you know, Jordan Love and things of that nature. Just, he, it just embrace your situation. I think he, he's done that. Um, but uh, Jets quarterback, and he threw for a ball just five times with his big highlight reel pass, a 57-yard bomb down the left sideline to Malik Taylor. So you clearly know that was a crazy situation. Uh, Wilson didn't do much else outside of that, connecting on two more passes for a total of eight yards and for 65 on the night. So it's preseason. You know, um, the rust was seen on both sides to start this one as the Browns missed a field goal on the opening drive, which was followed by a Jets punt and a Cleveland punt. Uh, Greg Zellerin. Uh, finally got the Jets on the board with a 54-yard field goal on the Jets' second drive to put points on the board in Canton. A fumble from the Browns will lead to more Jets points, with Zerlin kicking through a 44-yarder to make it 6-0 at the end of the first quarter. So you clearly see what's going on out here, ladies and gentlemen. The Browns, you know, they're on the up and ups. Let me know what was your thoughts when... Um, he did his thing at the end. You know, he took the lead. And um, the Jets, we well, listen, wait till, the, wait till the Jets get the firepower. We all know the Jets. They didn't play their starters. So 
And nonetheless, man, this is a good time to rejoice. The Browns took down the Jets in the first game of the NFL season. It's the preseason. It's flight sports. For more preseason NFL coverage, subscribe now.